Hello and welcome back. In this tutorial, we are going to be talking about the points of intersection of a circle and a line. There are three ways that a straight line can interact with a circle or any curve. Number one is when a line touches the circumference of a circle or of a curve only once. Such a line is called a tangent to the curve. In this case, you will get only one solution, which gives us a single point of intersection. We can get this graphically or by solving the equation of the circle or curve and the equation of the line simultaneously. If you are to form a quadratic equation, there will only be one repeated real root, b squared minus 4ac equal to 0. Let us look at this example. Show that the line y is equal to 5x minus 6 is a tangent to the curve y is equal to x squared plus x minus 2. So in this case, what we want to prove is that the line of given equation touches the curve, which is a quadratic curve in this case, y is equal to x squared plus x minus 2 only once. Now in order to prove this, we are going to take the two equations and solve them simultaneously. Since both equations are written in uh, in y in terms of x, then we can simply say x squared plus x minus 2 is equal to 5x minus 6. If we take this to the left-hand side, then we are going to have x squared plus x minus 2 minus 5x plus 6 equal to 0. And by simplifying, finally we will get x squared minus 4x plus 4 equal to 0. Now, since we now have this quadratic uh, equation formed by, by combining the two equations, that is, the equation of the line and the equation of the curve, now we can test using the discriminant b squared minus 4ac to see the number of roots that we get. So since a is equal to 1 and b is minus 4 and c is 4, then the discriminant b squared minus 4ac will give us minus 4 squared minus 4 of 1 of 4. And simplifying this, we get 16 minus 16, which equal to 0. And since b squared minus 4ac is giving us 0, then this shows us that we only have one real root. And thus proof that the line y is equal to 5x minus 6 is truly a tangent to the curve y is equal to x squared plus x minus 2. The other ways in which a circle interacts with a line are number 2. When a line intersects with a circle or with a curve twice. In such a case, we have two roots and we, if we are going to solve the two equations, that is the equation of the line and the equation of the curve simultaneously, then b squared minus 4ac should come out being greater than 0. It means we have two distinct roots, which gives us two distinct points of intersection. The third and final interaction would be when the line does not even touch a curve or a circle. In such a case, b squared minus 4ac is less than 0. So these here are the three ways that a line interacts with a curve.